You know, one of the best places to find those hidden secret stashes of powder snow, even after a snowfall, even if it was a snowfall a few days ago, is here in the trees. You know, we're surrounded by these beautiful British Columbia softwoods. The key word here, though, isn't so much soft, it's wood. So it's hard. A helmet, which is never a bad idea, might be something that you want to consider if you're going to head off into the trees. Secondly, what I like to do is I like to ski in the trees with my pole straps off. That way if my pole gets snagged on a, on a branch or it gets stuck in a hole, I can let it go. It's not going to spin me around and wipe me out, or worse still, hurt my shoulder. And then the last thing, and probably the most important thing to keep in mind if you're going to head into the trees, is to go with a buddy. I got my good buddy LG behind the camera there, so if something should go wrong, he's there to help me out. Let's go try a few more turns down here. When you first start skiing in the trees, looking for some big wide open spaces is the best place to start. Here in the Black Forest is perfect because I've got lots of room and I can see a long ways ahead. You know, where you look in the trees is really important. You don't want to be dazzled by those pretty pine needles because you'll be picking them out of your teeth later. What's really important is that you look at the spaces. It's amazing the spots that you can fit through if you're looking ahead and you look at the spaces. Let's go try a few more. Let me show you my perspective through the trees here. So it's kind of a connect the dots with the spaces. So I just look at the openings. Each time I'm just looking at the opening, not so much at the tree, always the space. So getting comfortable in the trees really opens up the mountain to you. you do a little bit of exploring, some mock piece stuff, find those secret stashes of powder snow. So I'm looking for the spaces, always looking for the spaces. There's a good opening right there. Whew. So remember those few safety points. A helmet, it's always a great idea. Take those safety straps off on your poles. Always go with a buddy and look for the open spaces. I hope that works for you. So we'll see you next time. I'm Josh Foster from beautiful Big White Ski Resort here in the sunny Okanagan.